Question, is Donald Trump a Jew or a Christian? Um, or a deceiver? <laughs> uh, you can give me your thoughts in the comments section down below, but I've seen some proof that Donald Trump converted to Judaism back in 2017. And uh, certainly he is very, uh, very much pro-Israel and whatever, which um, I'm for the Jews being in their land, that's fine. But the Jews being in other countries and ruling other countries and getting other countries to do their uh, war, you know, uh, fighting in war and whatever else, uh, no, I'm not for that. But um, so you, here you have a proof of Donald Trump saying that he converted to Judaism, or they, they're saying that they, he converted to Judaism back in 2017. But then you have other videos where he comes out and he's saying that he's a Christian. I think a Presbyterian or something like this. And his wife, I think it was a Roman Catholic or something or whatever. And you say, well, it, you know what, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because you can be both a Christian and a Jew. Um, no, you can't. Okay, the only way that that works would be like the Apostle Paul, where um, ethnically speaking, he was Jewish. Um, but uh, talks about that in Romans chapter 11. But spiritually, he was a Christian. And Acts, or, uh, Galatians chapter 3, verse 28 says about that there's neither Jew nor Gentile. We're all one in Christ Jesus. Male, female, bond or free. But the whole point is, when you are in Christ, when you get saved, you no longer say, I'm a Jewish Christian or something. No. Um, ethnically, yes, you can identify as a Jew. But spiritually, there's no such thing as a Jewish Christian. You can't be both um, into Judaism and into Christianity. It doesn't work. You say, what about Messianic Jews or whatever else? It's not a New Testament term. And if you're into the whole Messianic Jew thing, what you need to do is you need to get out of that. You need to, need to repent of that thing and just call yourself a Christian. Well, then I get lumped in with Catholicism and whatever. Yeah, well, so do I. I say I'm a Christian. And, you know, I get Catholics and they'll say, oh, I'm a Christian too. And, no, you're not. You're a Roman Catholic. Um, so you have to understand that thing from the scriptures. And uh, so what is Donald Trump? Well, the third option, I believe, a deceiver. That's what I think he is. Um, being all things to all men. And uh, not like the Apostle Paul who said, I am made all things to all men. Okay, it's one thing if God puts you through a lot of different experiences so that you can witness to people. That's one thing. But if you're um, getting into this ecumenical stuff and I'm going to be, to the Jews I'll be a Jew and to the Christians I'll be a Christian. And whatever group I'm speaking to, I'll pander to them. Uh, that's just being a deceiver. And um, what a lot of Christians don't understand, another point I need to make here, a lot of Christians think to themselves that the Pharisees and the Sadducees, they kind of died out in the first century and Jews today are just kind of walking around ignorantly doing their Old Testament stuff saying, we don't know anything about Jesus. We're just waiting for some Christian to come and tell us about Jesus so we can get saved. Uh, that's not reality. Uh, that is definitely not reality. Uh, the reality of it is that the Jews of today, um, especially the rabbis, uh, they hate Jesus. They despise Jesus Christ. They do their part to try to kick Jesus out of society. I remember I was going to a Baptist church years ago in Lincoln, outside of Ephrata, PA, Liberty Baptist Church, and there was an old school, and that school actually had been shut down by one Jewish woman. They were going to do a Christmas play at that school, and the Christmas play was about Jesus, and uh, she said that it was persecution of her Jewish faith and all this other stuff. I understand why, how, how uh, Jesus is persecuting you if you're a Jew, <laughs> but whatever, that's another issue. A little bit thin-skinned, but see, they understand that they can use this propaganda of anti-Semitism. Oh, you're a Nazi, or oh, you know, and they'll they do this little thing like that, and that gives them, you know, the leverage that they need to force their ways on other people. But this woman complained, and uh, they actually didn't just shut down the Christmas play; they shut down the whole school because of one complaining Jewish woman. The wrath of God has come upon them to the to the uttermost.
You say, well, that's anti-Semitic New Testament. Um, well, actually, if you read in the Old Testament, it says very similar things. The Old Testament's very rough on the Jewish people as well. They're very contrary people. So, Donald Trump, is he a Jew? Is he a Christian? Or do you think he's a deceiver? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching.